Hello everyone and welcome to my Emmerdale News YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. From Eric Pollard's shocking secret to a cancer diagnosis and a disgusting scheme that backfires on Tom King, viewers of Emmerdale are in for another exciting week in the town. Next week on Emmerdale, viewers can expect a flurry of turmoil. Belle Dingle, Tom King's ex-girlfriend, is the target of another cunning plan that Tom King is planning, but it goes horribly wrong. Following her breakup with Liam Cavanaugh, Ella Forster is thinking about leaving the village. In other news, Ruby Fox Milligan is surprised by the unexpected appearance of her estranged father, who has a big disclosure for his daughter, while town mainstay Eric Pollard reveals a huge truth that shocks his neighbors. The top seven spoilers for the next week are listed here. Amelia tries to convince Nicola. Amelia tries to convince Nicola, Tom implores her to believe in him, but she becomes enraged when Jimmy supports Tom. Tom feigns prayer at the church in an attempt to win Amelia over. When Tom says he wants them to get engaged eventually, she immediately warms up to him and consents to correct Nicola about her boyfriend. Nicola is still skeptical of their united front, so Tom and Amelia go to the cafe to speak with her. Tom's Most Recent Evil Plan Later, before Sam steps in, Tom suggests that they move in with Amelia. After being shocked by what he just heard, Sam is disappointed when he goes to the police station and is told that there is nothing more they can do to stop Tom. The next day, Belle is upset because the investigation into Tom has not advanced. Tom enters through the back door as she heads upstairs to take a bath. He slips about unnoticed, stealthily removing one of Belle's tops before leaving. When Belle runs into Tom, who makes fun of her, she becomes scared. Tom is finally caught up by justice. When Belle sees Amelia wearing what she believes to be her missing top, she is startled. The accusation surprises both Layla and Amelia, who grow agitated. Belle disappears in a panic. When an irate Tom chastises Amelia for her charges at home, she is left perplexed. Jimmy and D.S. Foy, who are there to take him to the station for interrogation, spot him as he escorts her out of the house with force. Tom makes another attempt to outsmart people, but he eventually faces justice. Liam gives Chaz a shocking revelation. When Manpreet learns that Ella intends to leave the community, she worries about her buddy. When Chaz hears Ella and Manpreet talking about Ella's living circumstances at the Woolpack, she feels bad. Manpreet's announcement that she has devised a plan leaves Ella perplexed. When Liam finds out about Ella's departure, he secretly visits Chaz in the back room. When Liam declares his love for her, Chaz is shocked. Ella becomes suspicious. When Liam learns that Ella and Manpreet are moving into Dale Head together rather than Ella leaving the area, he secretly feels let down. Before revealing her love for Liam, Chaz asks him to slow down their relationship after running into him. After hearing their heated exchange, Ella becomes suspicious. How much time will it take her to realize what's going on? Eric's Unexpected Declaration Brenda is thrilled when Eric unexpectedly announces a honeymoon cruise to everyone at their engagement party. Rodney questions Pollard's sudden affluence as the celebration goes on. Pollard panics and flees despite his evasive behavior, leaving a skeptical Layla in his wake. When Layla follows him home and Pollard makes a shocking admission, she is taken aback. Startling Cancer News Ruby begs Steph for another opportunity in a different area of the hamlet. Anthony returns with the startling news that he has been diagnosed with cancer. Touched by Anthony's predicament, Steph extends her assistance in the hopes that it will ease the tension between him and Ruby. Several former characters, such as Robert Sugden and Seb White, were mentioned in Emmerdale this week. Will they return to the ITV soap opera, though, and how are the characters related? This week, Ross Barton made his comeback after six years, which sparked unexpected news. After leaving the position in 2018, Mike Parr returned. In order to start again outside of the village, Ross and Rebecca relocated with son Seb. Robert Sugden, who was imprisoned for Lee Posner's 2019 death, has now also departed the village. Along with his new hidden brother John Sugden, Robert's sister Victoria Sugden and his ex-husband Aaron Dingle remain in the village. After John's arrival and Aaron's return last year, viewers have long anticipated Robert would make a comeback. 
However, how precisely is Robert connected to Rebecca and Seb, and will any of the characters be making a comeback soon? Ross revealed that Seb now resides with Rebecca's aunt, confirming Rebecca's death this week. The audience, however, is certain that Seb will return to the village shortly. Robert and Rebecca have a kid named Seb. When they lived in the village, Robert assisted in raising Seb. He was grieved by his departure in 2018. A year later, he was sent to prison and seemed to shut off all communication with his loved ones, however he continued to communicate with Rebecca and Seb. It's unclear if Robert and Rebecca or Seb had any conversations over the previous five or six years, but it appears that Robert didn't see him very much. Robert is aware of Rebecca's passing, as Ross confirmed in Thursday's episode that aired early on ITVX. He consented for this to occur and is aware that Seb currently resides with the aunt. Ross informed a startled Victoria that Robert had signed the documents granting the aunt the authority to look after Seb rather than him going back to the village. Seb isn't expected to return anytime soon, but could that change? Furthermore, is it possible that Robert will return as supporters have hoped? As far as we know, neither Robert nor Ryan Hawley have any plans to return to their respective roles. That doesn't mean it won't happen, though, because Aaron actor Danny Miller has previously acknowledged that he wants his co-star to return. Although there are persistent rumors, this will not be occurring for the time being. Rebecca also won't be showing up because it appears that she is actually dead. Since returning to Emmerdale, Ross Barton has been stirring things up. He's been teasing charity dingle, Emma Atkins, and reminding Billy Fletcher that he's already been there with his wife, Don Taylor. So early in the game, is he going to get his retribution? When it was discovered that Ross was Billy's opponent in the illegal fighting ring, he suddenly appeared in the village. In addition to fighting, he has been winding up Mac and slinging his weight around ever since he got back. He doesn't appear to have any intentions to go. When Caleb sees him leaving the B&B with his daughter Steph, he's even making time to get his leg over. I mean, Ross isn't afraid at all? Caleb offers Steph a position as his partner in his new depot in an effort to win her approval and keep her around. For Ross, who believes he can exploit her to get a new job, this sounds ideal. To keep Steph satisfied, Caleb initially offers Jai a job. At first, Jai rejects the offer, but Laurel persuades him. However, he later discovers that Steph is his new employer. He is unhappy because he has been taken advantage of. Ross, being the stupid fool that he is, shows up for work, assuming Caleb would hire the man who is having sex with his daughter. He is sent packing by Caleb, but a disgraced Jai sees a fresh chance. He's planning a retaliation. He contacts Ross and proposes that they work together to take part of Caleb's priceless stock because he is ready to exact revenge on Caleb. Ross is more than happy to help, distract Carrie and go for the kill, it's an easy task. While Ross makes the move, Jai handles Carrie, Laura Norton, in a double-team maneuver. He quickly heads to a barn to unload his lot after packing the stock onto a van. The sweetest transaction he's ever made. He's going to be shocked, though, for who does he discover hiding among his stock? Steph. He has been caught red-handed for underestimating Caleb's children. This one cannot be avoided by smarmy words. Emmerdale's shocking mentions of past characters this week is a return on the horizon? Emmerdale fans were left buzzing with excitement and heartbreak this week as the ITV soap aired surprising mentions of iconic past characters, including Robert Sugden and Seb White. These revelations came hot on the heels of Ross Barton's unexpected return to the village after six years, with Mike Parr reprising his role in a dramatic storyline twist. As Ross shared devastating news about Rebecca White's tragic death, questions arose about how these beloved characters are connected and whether we might see some long-awaited returns to the Dales. Could Robert Subden, Seb White, or even other surprise faces from the past make a dramatic comeback? Here's everything we know about the twists and turns in this evolving storyline. The Shocking Return of Ross Barton Ross Barton's return was a bombshell moment for fans, marking the end of his six-year absence. After leaving Emmerdale in 2018 with Rebecca White and their son Seb, Ross had seemingly found a fresh start far away from the turmoil of the village. However, his reappearance this week came with heartbreaking news, Rebecca has tragically passed away, leaving Seb in the care of her aunt. 
Ross dropped the news in a conversation with Victoria Sugden, revealing that Robert Sugden had been informed of Rebecca's death and had even signed papers to allow Seb's aunt to take custody. This revelation raises questions about Robert's continued absence and the emotional impact on Victoria, who has always been close to her brother and deeply cared for Seb. Robert Sugden's Complicated Exit and Lingering Legacy Robert Sugden, played by Ryan Hawley, was last seen in the village in 2019 after being sent to prison for the death of Lee Posner. His departure devastated fans, especially as it also marked the end of his iconic relationship with Aaron Dingle, fondly dubbed Rob Ron by viewers. Since then, Robert has been mentioned sporadically, but his connection to the village remains strong. His sister Victoria Sugden continues to live in Emmerdale, as does his ex-husband Aaron, who made a dramatic return last year. Adding further intrigue, the arrival of Robert's secret brother, John Sugden, has sparked fan theories about whether Robert could one day re-enter the fold. While Robert's name has been frequently brought up, Thursday's episode provided a rare glimpse into his current involvement in the lives of those he left behind. Despite being in prison, it was revealed that Robert was aware of Rebecca's death and had made a significant decision regarding Seb's future. The Heartbreaking Truth About Rebecca White and Seb Rebecca White, a character loved for her resilience and charm, was confirmed to have died in the latest episodes. Ross's revelation that Rebecca had passed away was a gut-wrenching moment, leaving fans speculating about the circumstances surrounding her death. Seb, the son of Robert and Rebecca, now lives with Rebecca's aunt. This decision, apparently agreed upon by Robert himself, has left fans questioning whether Seb will ever return to the village that played such a significant role in his early years. Seb's connection to the village is undeniable. Raised by Robert and Rebecca during their time in Emmerdale, Seb became a symbol of hope and redemption for Robert after a turbulent few years. His departure with Rebecca and Ross in 2018 marked a bittersweet end to this chapter, but recent developments suggest his story is far from over. Will Seb White return to Emmerdale? Fans are already speculating about the possibility of Seb's return, especially after Ross's reappearance and the revelations about Rebecca's death. While Robert's decision to let Seb stay with Rebecca's aunt suggests he might not return immediately, Emmerdale has a history of surprising viewers with dramatic twists. Seb's ties to the Sugden family, particularly Victoria and Aaron, make his potential return an emotional and compelling storyline waiting to happen. Could Seb come back to the village seeking answers about his parents and a connection to the family he barely knows? Could Robert Sugden make a comeback? Perhaps the most burning question for fans is whether Robert Sugden could return to Emmerdale. While there are no confirmed plans for Ryan Hawley to reprise the role, the character's deep ties to the village and ongoing mentions in recent episodes keep hope alive. Aaron Dingle's return last year reignited speculation about Robert's comeback, with Danny Miller, who plays Aaron, publicly expressing his desire to reunite with his former co-star. The chemistry between Robert and Aaron remains one of the most celebrated storylines in the soap's history, and fans are clamoring for the chance to see the duo back on screen. However, as it stands, Robert remains in prison with no plans for release or a return to Emmerdale. Still, soap operas are known for their unexpected twists, and viewers know better than to rule out a dramatic comeback. What's next for Ross Barton? Ross's return has already delivered plenty of drama, but his storyline is far from over. With Rebecca's death leaving him a single parent once again, how will he navigate life back in the village? Ross's interactions with Victoria Sugden have sparked speculation about whether the two might form a closer bond in the wake of recent events. Could Victoria step in to help Ross as he adjusts to life without Rebecca, or will Seb's absence lead Ross down a darker path? Fan Theories, The Future of the Subden Legacy The mentions of Robert Subden, Seb White, and Rebecca White this week have reignited fan theories about the future of the Subden Legacy. Could Seb eventually return to the village to reclaim his place within the family? Will Robert find a way to reconnect with his loved ones despite his imprisonment? Some fans even speculate that Seb's return could pave the way for dramatic confrontations and emotional reunions. With Victoria, Aaron, and now John Sugden in the village, the stage is set for a powerful storyline centered around family, redemption, and the enduring ties that bind the Sugdens together. Conclusion, the door is always open. 
While there are currently no official plans for the return of Robert Sugden, Seb White, or other past characters, Emmerdale has proven time and time again that anything is possible. Ross Barton's shocking comeback is a testament to the soap's ability to surprise and delight viewers, and the mentions of Robert and Seb suggest their stories are far from over. As fans eagerly await the next twist in this gripping saga, one thing is clear, the Sugden family's legacy remains a cornerstone of Emmerdale's rich history, and its future is brimming with possibilities. Stay tuned, as the village is never short of drama, and the next big surprise could be just around the corner. Ross Barton's return to Emmerdale sparks chaos, but will he get his comeuppance? Ross Barton, Michael Parr, is back in Emmerdale, and he's wasted no time ruffling feathers. Whether it's cracking on with Charity Dingle, Emma Atkins, throwing shade at Mac Boyd, Lawrence Robb, or reminding Billy Fletcher, Jay Consul, that he's already been there with Don Taylor, Olivia Bromley, Ross seems determined to leave his mark. But with his brash behavior and bold schemes, is Ross about to get his comeuppance before he even settles in? Ross Barton's Explosive Return Ross made his unexpected comeback during a dramatic underground fighting ring showdown, where he was revealed as Billy's opponent. Fans were stunned to see him back in the village, fists flying and charisma oozing. But Ross didn't stop there, he's been stirring up trouble left and right. His swagger has certainly turned heads, but not always for the right reasons. He's quickly managed to wind up Mac by flirting with Charity, while also throwing his weight around in the village, making it clear he's here to stay. And when it comes to relationships, Ross is living up to his reputation. Ross and Steph, a dangerous liaison. In typical Ross fashion, he's already landed himself in hot water with Caleb Milligan, Will Ash, after being spotted leaving the BNB with Caleb's daughter, Steph, Ruby Fox Milligan. Caleb, not one to take things lightly, is furious. Steph, however, seems smitten with Ross's bad boy charm, and Caleb hatches a plan to keep her close. He offers her a role as his partner in his new business venture, The Depot. The arrangement appears perfect for Ross, who sees Steph as a ticket to a new job. But Caleb isn't about to let Ross off the hook so easily. Jai Sharma's Revenge Plan While Caleb is busy placating Steph, he also tries to keep her happy by offering Jai Sharma, Chris Bisson, a position at the depot. Initially, Jai isn't interested, but after some persuasion from Laurel, Charlotte Bellamy, he reluctantly accepts. However, his mood quickly sours when he realizes that Steph, Caleb's daughter, is his new boss. Feeling duped and furious, Jai begins plotting his revenge. Meanwhile, Ross naively strolls into the depot, assuming Caleb will give him a job despite his involvement with Steph. Caleb, naturally, sends Ross packing, leaving him humiliated. But Jai sees an opportunity to strike back. Teaming up with Ross, Jai devises a plan to steal some of Caleb's valuable stock. Ross, always up for mischief, eagerly agrees. The heist that goes wrong. Their plan is simple, distract Caleb's trusted employee, Carrie Wyatt, Laura Norton, and make off with the goods. Jai handles Carrie with some smooth talking, while Ross sneaks in and loads up a van with the stolen stock. Everything seems to be going smoothly, until Ross arrives at the drop-off location. As he begins unloading the goods in an abandoned barn, he gets the shock of his life. Hiding among the stolen stock is none other than Steph. Caught red-handed. Steph's presence reveals just how much Ross underestimated her and Caleb. She's been one step ahead of them all along, and now Ross finds himself cornered. His usual charm and quick thinking won't get him out of this one. What happens next remains to be seen, but one thing is clear, Ross Barton is in deep trouble. Fan Reactions to Ross's Return Ross's comeback has ignited a storm of reactions from Emmerdale fans. Many are thrilled to see Michael Parr back on screen, bringing his signature swagger and charm to the village. But others are skeptical about Ross's chances of redemption, especially with the chaos he's already caused. Will Ross manage to turn things around? or is he destined for another dramatic exit? Fans will have to stay tuned to find out. What's next for Ross? Ross has always been a survivor, but his recent antics have landed him in hot water with some of the village's most formidable residents. As Caleb, Jai, and Steph close in on him, it's clear that Ross will need more than his usual bravado to escape unscathed. Could this be the beginning of the end for Ross Barton in Emmerdale, or will he manage to outsmart his enemies once again? 
One thing's for sure, Ross's return is already shaping up to be one of the most explosive storylines of the year. Stay tuned to Emmerdale for the latest twists and turns as Ross's misadventures continue to unravel in the weeks ahead. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update.